Eddie from Harlem Bling, if you own any silver jewelry or plan on buying any silver jewelry, this is going to be a very important video. We're going to talk about what is silver oxidation? How do you prevent it? And yes, there are ways to prevent silver from oxidizing. And how do you clean it if it already has happened? But first, I want all of you hit that subscribe button down below and comment what city and state you're from. I want to fill up the whole country on the map. So guys, what is silver oxidation? Silver is an element in the periodic table, AG. When silver gets combined with oxygen molecules, it starts developing a black surface. These are 100 year old coins. This is maybe a 20 year old spoon I just took from my kitchen. And this is a chain that's maybe a year old. And that's why the oxidation is very slight. It just started turning yellow. It's a chemical process and nothing could be done to avoid it. Well, there is a few things and we'll touch upon that in a few minutes. The good thing about it is that it's not permanent. It could be cleaned and it could be avoided. This chain that's made from brass this is permanent. This just means that the slight layer of silver or nickel, whatever this company used, wore off, and the copper is shown. This chain could be cleaned. Oxidation is actually a good thing. It makes a lot of jewelry. We use it all the time. So this ring, if you notice the black parts, this is oxidation that we did on purpose. If you take this chain, for instance, it's oxidized to give it a more vintage look. If we do it even more, you'll get something like this, which is completely black and it has a beautiful shimmer. Our Cubans that are made in Mexico, they're also oxidized. It's very slight, but if any of you could see it, and it gives the jewelry a very unique look that I personally love myself. Now, how do you prevent oxidation? Well, the easiest thing, and this will shock a lot of you, is wear your items every day. When you're wearing your item, your skin rubs on the chain and it sort of cleans it. And remember, this process happens when the chain is exposed to oxygen, not when it's exposed to your skin. On this trash, the more you'll wear it, the more it will turn into more garbage. Silver, however, the longer you store it. If you take silver chains and you store them on the shelves, that's when they will become oxidized. But you're going to ask, well, you have a lot of chains on your shelves. Why are they not oxidized? First of all, if you notice, we keep them in special bags. So these bags contain copper. We actually bought them to you guys on our website in the merch section. You will see us selling these products. These are copper bags. We partnered up with a company called Intercept. They're very inexpensive. If you put your jewelry in there like we do over here, it will not tarnish for a few years. We also have jewelry bags, special jewelry bags, bigger bags, a lot of different things. My favorite are these anti-tarnish strips. They're extremely cheap. Or these pads. So you take your jewelry box, you drop a pad like this, it will keep your jewelry tarnish free for a few years. So these pads, they have copper embedded in the fibers. So the oxygen will turn this instead of your chain. It's a very interesting concept. Again, look at these coins from a hundred years ago compared to a coin that was kept in a case. You will see how it oxidizes. It happens to spoons, forks. It's a completely natural process. Listen, a lot of you guys go buy jewelry from us, then leave us a bad review. You sold us a fake chain. Why? 
I hit you guys up. Why? Why is our chain fake? Because it became black. No, silver becomes black if not worn every day and stored. So what do you do once your chain is already oxidized? I'm not going to get into all the details how you clean it, but something very simple like baking soda. There's professional silver cleaner you can buy on Amazon for only a few dollars. And there's actually a lot of different methods. You just have to Google it and do it. It is very simple. Once you clean your chain, it will look like brand new again. The only thing is, do it only if it's real silver. I can vouch for mine. I can vouch for a lot of other companies out there. Because if you do it with items that are not real silver, this is what's going to happen. Until next time, Eddie from Harlem Black.